Hey guys, come on downstairs. We're playing UC Santa Barbara Gauchos baseball here on Mama's Basement. It's series number two of the year as we host the Washington State Cougars out of the Pac-10. The Cougars come in at 0-2 and we are 1-1 one and one, splitting a season or a series opener with the San Jose State Spartans. Patrick Casanova takes the hill for us, his first start of the year. And he will face Nick Macier to lead off the ball game. And we are underway in our home opener here in Santa Barbara. Ground ball to Regan at short on to Dessa at first for out number one. Next batter is Sullivan. He takes a breaking ball just low for a ball. And then he lays down a bunt. Casanova fields it on to Dessa at first as you see the batting order. Ruth is up next for Washington State. Here is Ruth. Batting from the right side. Ground ball to Helton at second. On to Dessau at first. And a quick top of the first inning for Santa Barbara. Here comes Izzy Venhola. Making his first start of the year for the Cougars. Helton, Carson, and Farinacci do up. Here in the top of the first, the lefty delivers. Strike one. To Jeremy Helton, the second baseman, leading off the ball game for the Gauchos. Helton takes a cutter for strike two. And a big sweeping curveball. And that is out number one. Ball taken inside for ball one. Swing and a miss on the fastball. We've got a 1 1 count. The delivery flared out into right field where Macier is underneath it for Washington State, and he makes the catch and records out number two. Up next, Daniel Farinacci, a right fielder. He's got some pop in his bat, one of our better hitters. First pitch to Farinacci, that big breaking ball, big slow curveball breaks inside for ball one. Cutter catches the inside corner. We've got a 1-1 count. Here is the delivery splitter just off the plate. 2-1 count. Another breaking ball. Splits the plate. 2-2 two -two count with two outs. Here's the delivery. Uh, Farinacci grounds it short. The throw onto first. Pulls the first baseman off the bag. Poor throw there by Baldelli. And Santa Barbara has their first base runner of the game. Cutter. On the inside corner, 0-1. Ground ball up the middle. Runner's gonna go first to third on the base hit. And with two outs, Santa Barbara has a runner in scoring position for first baseman Dessa. And this is a ground ball to second where Kales plays it onto St. Julian at first for out number three. At the end of one, no score. Ryan Salazar, the catcher. Leading things off in the top of the second inning. He takes the fastball for strike one. From Casanova. Two seam fastball breaks in off the plate. Here's the 1-1 one -one delivery. Taken high. And the breaking ball is jumped on and laced into left field for a base hit. Conradi gets it back into the infield and... Washington State has their first base runner of the game, and here's the first baseman, St. Julian. He goes opposite field with this one, and it gets in for a base hit. So the first two batters of the inning are on base, and that brings up Eric Wise with nobody out. Two-seam fastball catches the inside corner. Ground ball to the right side. Helton can't get to it. And Washington State has the bases loaded. For designated hitter Carl Mears. Here's the delivery from Casanova. Splitter. Taken for strike one. Swing and a miss on the splitter for uh, strike two. And the third delivery of breaking ball. Down and away. Gets him on strike. So there's one out here for Kales. And he flies this one into shallow right field. Farinacci coming in. Makes the catch. Almost into the infield. And Washington State will have the bases loaded for Baldelli with two outs now. 
trying not to squander this opportunity to get on the board, and Baldelli flies this one into left field. Conradi's underneath it, and he will make the catch to retire the side. The Cougars strand three. In the middle of two, we still have no score. Here is Nate Coltrinari, designated hitter for the Gauchos. The delivery from Venola. Splitter taken for strike one. Second pitch is fouled off. And the splitter just off the plate. One-two count with nobody out. Another breaking ball off the plate. And a ground ball to the left side. It is played by Baldelli. On to first. For out number one, Tyler Drever, the catcher, comes to the plate. First pitch changeup. Second pitch, a splitter that's high and inside. Another splitter in the same spot. It's a 2-1 count now. The delivery from Venola. This one catches the inside corner. Three straight splitters and then a cutter off the outside edge. Full count now. The delivery, a curveball, is high. And that'll put a runner on first for left fielder 10 Conradi. Ted Conradi. Breaking ball for strike one. Fastball swung on and missed. 0-2 count with one out. Runner on first. The delivery from Venola. Curveball but catches the back door for out number two. That brings up center fielder Zerby. 0-1 count. Zerby. Chopper. Up the middle. Filled it at short by Baldelli. On to St. Julian. For out number three. At the end of two, we still have no score. Matt Ruth comes to the plate. He's batting 727 in the young season. With two outs in the top of the third inning, he grounds out to Helton at second. In the middle of three, we have no score from Santa Barbara, California. Daniel Farinacci now with two outs in the bottom of the third. He swings on a breaking ball for strike one. Delivery from Venola, ground ball to second. Played by Kales onto St. Julian, and the side is retired. At the end of three, it's Washington State nothing and Santa Barbara nothing. Ryan Salazar steps in now in the fourth. He's going to fly this one out to left field. Conradi's underneath it, and Conradi squeezes it for out number one. It'll bring up Jim St. Julian. First delivery to St. Julian, also lifted to left field. Conradi's underneath that one for out number two. Third baseman, Eric Wise. One for one on the day. Here's the delivery to him. He takes a fastball low and inside for ball one. Splitter low and outside for ball two. Two one delivery is a fastball that's low. 3-0 count to Wise. Casanova gets the splitter over for strike one. And the splitter swung on and missed for strike two. Full count with two outs. And the curveball gets him. In the middle of four, still no score. John Regan will lead off the bottom of the fourth for the Gauchos. Regan takes strike one. Change up, swung on and missed for strike two. Fouled back. Here's the 0-2 delivery from Venola. And this one is lined up the middle for a base hit. And the Gauchos have their leadoff runner on. Curveball for strike one from Venola. And then a drive deep to left field. And that one is going to be caught in left by Matt Ruth. It'll bring up Nate Coltrinari with one out and one on. The lefty facing the left-handed pitcher, Izzy Venola. 0-1 count. Fastball swung on and missed. 0-2 delivery is taken into right field. Coming in is center fielder Sullivan, and he'll make the catch. So two outs. Here's Tyler Drever. Drever looks at ball one. Drever lines this one into left field. That one is back. It's at the track, and the catch is made by Ruth right at the wall. At the end of four, we still have no score. Here in Santa Barbara, California, Carl Mears. Leading off the top of the fifth, he flies it out to right field. Farinacci's underneath it. And Farinacci records out number one. Mike Kale steps into the box now. 
Still facing Casanova and Kales is going to line a base hit right back up the middle. And with one out, Wazoo has a runner on for Baldelli. Baldelli squares the bunt, pulls it back for ball one. Two-seamer down and in for ball two. And Casanova falls behind Baldelli 3-0. And the fastball taken for ball number four. So we got runners on first and second for Nick Macier. Macier swings through strike one. Two on with one out. Splitters for strike two. Here's the delivery from Casanova. And this one is lined into left field. That one's going to get past Conradi to the wall. One run's going to score. Another runner coming to the plate. And it is a two RBI double for Macier. And Washington State jumps out in front in the top of the fifth inning. Kevin Sullivan steps in now. Still just one out in the top of the fifth. Runner on second. Sullivan pops it into shallow left field. Conradi in. And he calls off the shortstop, Regan, and makes the catch. Here's Matt Ruth. 0 for 2 on the day. Ruth swings at the splitter. 0-1 count. Here's the delivery. 0-2 now. And the breaking ball is fouled off. Here's the delivery from Casanova. High fastball taken for ball one. We got a one-two count with two outs. And the curveball swung on and missed. In the middle of five, Washington State has taken the lead two to nothing. Santa Barbara will try to answer. Here's Rafael Carson. Carson takes a big hack at that one and fouls it off. Ground ball to short. On to second for out number one. There will be no play at first. That's the end of the inning. In the middle, or at the end of five, excuse me, Washington State still leading two to nothing. Here's Eric Wise. Top of the sixth inning for the Cougs. Casanova still on the hill for, uh, for Santa Barbara. And here is a high fly ball into left field. Conradi's underneath it. And in the middle of six, it is two to nothing. Washington State, Farinacci, Regan, and Dessa do up for the Gauchos. Farinacci will lead things off in the bottom of the sixth. Izzy Venela still pitching for Washington State. 0-2 oh, count. And it is grounded to the right side. Diving play made by St. Julien. And he will get up and step on the bag for out number one. John Regan, the shortstop, batting 273 on the year. And he hits one deep into right field. That one is back. It's at the track, at the wall, and it's gone. John Regan, three for three today. A 422 foot home run for Regan. And that gets the Gauchos on the board. It's two to one. Warren Dessau now, he's batting 300 on the year. And he's gonna swing at the first pitch and loft it into right field where it is played by Macier. For out number two, here's Coltrinari. Coltrinari swings and misses at the breaking ball. 0-1 count, changeup taken inside. 1-1 one, one count. Coltrinari flares it out into left. Catch is made by Matt Ruth, and that'll end the inning. Santa Barbara gets on the board, cuts the lead in half. It's 2-1 Wazoo. And Carl Mears steps in, and he gets out. I'm sorry. <laughs> Didn't get his at bat. So it's Baldelli now with two outs in the seventh, and he is going to get a base hit up the middle to extend the inning. And here is Nick Macier with the two-run home run for Washington State. He grounds it back up the middle. Casanova makes the play to end the inning. We're in the middle of seven here in Santa Barbara. It's two to one. Washington State. Z uh, Jim Zerby steps in with two outs. And nobody on. He swings and misses. And then swings and misses at a circle change. 0-2 delivery. Grounded up the middle. Play made by Baldelli on to first. And the side is retired. We're through seven. And it is two to one, Washington State on six hits and two errors. And the new pitcher for UCSB is Laskanik, the lefty. And Laskanik 
Gets ahead 0-2 to his first batter. Ground ball to the right side, Helton. On to Dessau for the first out. Matt Ruth to the plate now. He's batting 615 on the year, but 0 for 3 today. And there's his first base hit of the ball game. Farinacci will field it. And Washington State has a runner on first for Ryan Salazar. Salazar to the plate. Santa Barbara checks on the runner, and Sal Salazar grounds it up the middle. Runner heading to third, and he will reach. And we got runners on the corners for Jim St. Julien. St. Julien on the ground to Dessa. Dessa to second for out number one, and they can't turn the double play. The runner will come in from third and score. It's three to one, Washington State. Here's the delivery from Laskanik. 0-1 count, now 0-2 with two outs. Pot fly into foul territory in right field. Farinacci is going to reach it. He will make the play, and that will end Washington State's half of the eighth inning. They tack one on to lead 3-1. to one. Here is Jeremy Helton now in the bottom of the eighth. Helton leads things off. Ground ball to third. Wise on to Julian for out number one. Santa Barbara third baseman Raphael Carson steps in. He takes the slider on the outside corner for strike one. Then fouls one off. He's behind 0-2. And they check down at first. He didn't go around. 1-2 count. Another pitch fouled off by Carson. And then he swings and misses at the circle change for out number one. Here's Daniel Farinacci. One of our best hitters, but he is only batting 100 so far. Slow start to the year for Farinacci, and he lines out to first. St. Julian makes the play. That ends the inning, and it is 3-1, Washington State. And the Gauchos will bring in Garter to pitch. The top of the ninth. Trying to keep the lead at two. Here's a foul ball. Carson. We'll run it down for the out. And that ends the, in, or uh, excuse me, Sean Manship is warming up in the bullpen for Washington State. He is their closer. With one out, here's the 0-1 delivery, a two-seamer. Breaks in off the plate. It's 1-1. One 1-2 one. One count on the foul ball now, 2-2. Two -two. And the curveball is taken for strike three. El Padillo Baldelli, one for two today. He takes ball one low. Two-seamer catches the corner. It's 1-1 one, one now with two outs. Swing and a miss on the curve. Garter looking for a quick 1-2-3 inning, and he's got it with the strikeout. In the middle of nine, it's Washington State three. UC Santa Barbara one. Manship comes in to try to nail down the save. For Wazoo. 0-2 oh, count now. Manship's delivery swung on and missed on the circle change. Here is Warren Dessau, the first baseman. 273 on the year. And he's going to ground it to first. St. Julien fills it. Steps on the bag, and that is out number two. So Nate Cotrinari trying to extend this game. 1-0 oh, count with two outs. Here's the delivery from Manship. It's down. 2-0 oh with two outs in the bottom of the ninth. Splitter taken for strike one. Swung on and missed for strike two. Santa Barbara needs a base runner. Here's the delivery. And it is ground or uh, flared into left field for a base hit. Over the jumping wise at third. And it'll bring on pinch hitter Yvonne Zayas. And he's going to foul it over to the right side. And that one's going to drop. It's 0-1 with two outs. Now 0-2 after another foul ball. And a ground ball to third. Wise makes the play. He's up with it. On to first, and that is your ball game. Washington State comes on the road and gets their first win of the season. 3-1 here in Santa Barbara. Washington State improves to 1-2 and two on the year. The Gauchos fall to 1-2. Quick look at the box score here. Macier one for two, or one for four, excuse me, with two RBIs. Sullivan was 0 for four, struck out once. 
Matt Ruth, one for four. Scored a run, struck out once. Salazar was two for four. First baseman, St. Julian, one for four with an RBI. Wise was one for four with a strikeout. Mayers, 0 for four with a strikeout. Kales was one for four, scored a run, struck out once. And Baldelli was one for three, he scored a run. Macier with a double. St. Julian and Macier with RBIs for Washington State. For us, Helton went 0 for 4. Carson went 0 for 4. Farinacci went 0 for 4. Never good when the top three batters in your order go a combined 0 for 12. Regan went 3 for 4 with an RBI and a run scored. Helton struck out three times on the day, our leadoff hitter. Dessa 0 for 4. Coltrinari was 1 for 4. Drever was 0 for 2. Walked once, struck out once, and Zayas was 0 for 1. So Regan hit the home run, the only RBI of the game for Santa Barbara. For Washington State, Venola went 6 and a third, three hits, one run, one walk, five strikeouts, and he gave up one home run. Glenn went one and two thirds, didn't give up any hits. Manship went one inning, he got the save. For us, Casanova gets the loss, he went seven innings, gave up six hits, two runs, four strikeouts, and a walk. Laskanik went one inning, two hits, one run. And Garter went one inning for us. Up next, we have game two of this series. It will be Sofsinski against McNamee. And we will go ahead and coach this one. And we'll speed it up. And Washington State gets the win. So they sweep this two-game series in Santa Barbara to send us to a 1-3 and three record. 8-2 to two win for Washington State. For us, Helton went one for four. Carson went two for five. Farinacci, two for four. Regan went 2 for 3, Dessa 2 for 4, Coltrinari 0 for 4, Geyer 1 for 4, Pazluzny was the catcher, he was 0 for 3, and Zerby went 1 for 3. A double for Regan and two RBIs for Dessa. For us, Sofsinski for the Gauchos went 3 and 2 thirds, gave up, or sorry, yeah, went 3 and 2 thirds, gave up 8 hits, 3 walks, a strikeout, and a home run. Meester went 4 and a third, gave up 3 hits, no runs, had 5 strikeouts. And Zayas went one inning, had one strikeout and a walk. Up next, we have the Troy Trojans. That will be at home again against Troy before we head out on the road to St. Mary's. A quick look at the Big West standings. Nobody has played any conference games yet. In non-conference play, we sit in seventh place at 1-3. and three. UC Riverside, the only team behind us at 1-5. and five. Cal Poly's 3 and 1, Cal State Fullerton is 4 and 2. All right, that's it for episode number 2 of UC Santa Barbara Dynasty here on Mama's Basement Sports Gaming MVP06 NCAA Baseball.